Hey guys, uh, in this video I'm going to talk about the documentation element and documentation header. Now uh, we haven't included them uh, into the documentation for the moment, but uh, we're planning to. This is actually something that we um, kind of uh, inherited from uh, older uh, versions, but we do try to maintain it as it's a cool thing. Now, uh, documentation is somehow like uh, like portfolio, but uh, oriented for uh, documentation or a structure like posts into categories. So let's just try to create a new page and. I'm going to say documentation test test. Going to publish. Edit this page with page builder. And I'm going to search for the documentation header. As you can see, uh, search form has appeared I will select uh, a nicer color and no bottom mask here as you can see it's uh, this kind of uh, subheader uh, is used for um, when used behind the the header and at the top of the website and generally of course used for uh, search uh, into the documentation now I'm going to create a section so I can have a decent uh, 12 column element and then I'm going to search for again for the documentation but uh, the content filtered as content yeah so the problem right here is that uh, it, it does not have any anything to show up so I'm just going to publish this and I'm going to the documentation items categories and I'm just going to create a testing category no parent just add the category I'm going to add new documentation doc one just some text yeah I published into the category yeah so I'm going to add another one doc two and let me just go back to the uh, yeah I've published it let me just refresh it as you can see the um, title of the category appears with the count of articles and here you can have the uh, sorry not articles but posts or documentation items and that's about it you can search through these uh, if you search if you're using this uh, search form you can use uh, you can search inside this uh, uh, these uh, documentation items now these elements are uh, nice to have and uh, they're probably very useful if you have a uh, something somewhere where you want to explain something we're actually using it into our support forums in uh, the documentation uh, uh, side of the uh, support forums and uh, I don't know if you have any questions or uh, feature requests of course just uh, drop us a message and 
will uh, will be glad to um, uh, reply so that's about it with this element uh, thanks for watching and see you in the next one bye